Hello and welcome to Creative Design and Supply. Today I want to take another one of our Color Splash Ultra DTF transfers and we are going to put it on a frame. And then I am going to put a photo and this um, adhesive on it. All right, so let's go ahead and I thought about bringing this down because this is a perfect size for it. And I am going to put some heat tape and I will sandwich it again. I don't want to put my hands in the middle of it because, all right. Okay. All right. And I am going to use my parchment paper like I did before. And this is just to protect the paint that I used. Um, one I did, uh, I didn't let it dry, the acrylic paint dry for 24 hours. So I went ahead and used it and where, where the uh, DTF clear transfer is not, it would stick to my paper. So I'm going to use parchment paper. This for um, at 285 degrees for 15 seconds. All right. So now I am going to let this cool and I think I'm going to turn it over and I am just going to cut this part out. All right, and I did not paint the bag just because this is a decoration. So let me see which one would be easier for me to use if it's just my little finger exacto. Okay, all right. All right. Oops. Okay, and then you can still, whoops, trim the excess if you want. All right, I think whenever I press this one more time, that may lay down. All right. There we go. And if you want to, to give it a little bit of a gloss or even um, over it, you can um, clear seal this. All right, so now let me go ahead and get my transfer tape. And this is a piece that I have used before. And I just roll it back onto it, the roll. Now these holographics, I will say you have to burnish really well because it has like a petroleum coating on it. And I will tell you, this is the easiest way is if you flip it over and you do it and pull it off. Okay. 
All right, so now And this stuff sticks really, really well. It does have the same glue as 651. And there we go. All right. If you have any questions, comment below. And I will be glad to answer them for you.